grand opening of the marketplace, we need some grand entertainment. Oh, and not just grand, very grand. I got it. We could give a dance recital. Yeah. I got it. We could juggle. Huh. I mean something big, something everyone will come to see. Something with star power. You want a big star? Hit Cherry Jam! Everybody else's. Only the biggest superstar in the whole very bitty world. Hey, why don't we ask her? Ask her what? To sing at the grand opening. Oh, come on. I was just kidding. Yeah, why would the world's biggest music star want to sing for us? I don't know, but could it hurt to ask? So, won't you please consider our request. Signed, your most adoring fan. Incredibly adoring. Incredibly adoring fan. Blueberry Muffin. Well, looks all right to me. Then here it goes. I can't believe I just emailed Cherry Jam. If she even reads it, the biggest music star in the whole world is going to come all the way to Berry Bitty City and perform for us? I don't think so. Yeah, Raspberry's right. She probably gets a million emails a day. Why would she answer ours? You guys are not going to believe this. See the real person in you. Uh, 
when they see the real friendship in you. When they see the real star shine in you. Oh, I'll never find the right ending. When they hear the real music in you. That's it! Sorry, I heard you singing and, well, the words just kind of came to me. Am I ever glad they did? Thank you. It's perfect. Would it be okay if I used your words in my song? Of course. I'm Strawberry. Hi, Strawberry. This is Pupcake and Custard. Oh, so cute. <laughs> and what's your name? Uh... Buttercup. Nice to meet you, Buttercup. Are you... Do you smell cherry blossoms? Oh, um, no. <laughs> I don't smell anything except strawberries. Uh, you were asking? Oh, uh, yes. I, I was going to ask if you're out here alone. Uh-huh. Just sort of driving through, and I've always wanted to have a picnic. You've never had a picnic before? Uh, well, no. Well, I'll let you enjoy. It was nice to meet you, Buttercup. Nice meeting you, too. Thank you for your help. Sure. Come on, guys. Back to the harvest. <laughs> Just like I hoped it would be. Cheers! <laughs> of the Cherry Jam Fan Club would like to extend a very big welcome to you and your entire entourage. No! <laughs> My entourage? You know, the people who go everywhere with you and wait on you hand and foot. Well, I kind of thought it'd be fun to kind of get away and come here on my own. I don't have an entourage with me. You do now! Uh, about Strawberry. Oh, shush. We're keeping you a secret until tomorrow. Come park over here. Here she comes! Make way Wait for Jerry Jam! Jerry Jam! For real, Cherry Jam wants me to call her by her first name? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Just try to think of me as one of you. Excuse me, but why the sleeping bag? We thought you always sleep in your fabulous tour bus when you're away from home. Not this time. I was looking forward to, you know, sleeping under the stars. Huh? You mean like a camp out? Exactly. A camp out. Oh, do we have the perfect camping spot for you? Uh, yeah, that's right. Just stay right here. Uh, relax, and we'll get it all ready for you. Yeah, let's go, girls. Oh, you're gonna love it! Why did you tell her that? We can't let her camp out. You know what she's used to? Five-star luxury. Six star. If we let her sleep in some old sleeping bag, she'll never want to come back again. So, here's the plan. Okay, do you guys remember the article? Now, it's really not much. Probably not what you're used to. We hope it's comfortable enough for a star. A star of super magnitude. That means really, really big. Well, what do you think? It is really big, isn't it? Don't you want to see the inside? <laughs> of course. We copied your bedroom from your article. Bedroom of a star in very big glitz and glamour. Everything you have when you're at home has been duplicated here. Well, probably not exactly, but we did our best. <laughs> Thank you. It's very thoughtful of you. This is a camp out fit for a star. That's what my managers and my agents and my entourage would say. Ooh, her entourage! Well, see you in the morning. Wow, 
just what I'd hoped for. Miss Jam? Cherry! Cherry? We brought you a little midnight snack. Cherry? Where could she be? <gasps> oh, no. Look! I guess she didn't like it. She didn't like it so much. She'd rather sleep outside. <sighs> we had our chance, and we failed. Oh, hi! Can you help me with these... Um... <laughs> what's going on? We need you to give the Grand Opening's guest star some information first. Guest star? Huh? Surprise! <laughs> Presenting... Cherry Jam! Your Cherry Jam? But you... you... <laughs> so that's why I smelled cherry blossoms when I first met you. Wow, you girls planned this? Oh, thank you. Our pleasure. <laughs> Here, quick. You don't want her to think we're just plain boring girls, do you? Well, we'll leave you to plan the grand opening. We have something we have to do. <laughs> <laughs> uh, wow. Well, um, here. Please, sit down, Buttercup. Um, Miss Jam? Oh, no. Please, call me Cherry. I'm sorry, Strawberry. I didn't want to give away the surprise. <laughs> I understand. I probably wouldn't have believed you anyway. You look quite different in person. I just dress that way because it's what my fans want. Well, I'm a fan of yours. Oh. But I'm also a fan of people dressing how they like. And I like the way you look right now. And I like that. I'm sorry, <laughs> but it's not really me. <laughs> not really me either. But don't tell. I won't tell a soul. <laughs> Mmm, that was the best sandwich I've ever had. Thanks, but you must have had better ones in Big Berry City. Nope. The best part, too, is being able to just relax without people snapping pictures of me. <sighs> it's so nice here. Well, can I show you where you're going to perform? Actually, the girls promised to take me out where I can do something I've always wanted to do. Something I never could do in the city with people following me everywhere. What's that? Take a walk all by myself and pick flowers. Oh, yes! Those big hothouse roses are your favorite. I read about it in Very Big Glitz and Glamour magazine. That's something my publicist made up. My real favorite flowers are buttercups. Hmm, uh, <laughs> of course. Does she like them? No. Aww. She doesn't like our flowers, either. She doesn't like them so much, she'd rather settle for ordinary wildflowers. We had our chance, and we failed. Better make sure I can find my way back. If we can't do something to impress her, she'll never come back. Hey, remember that article in Glitz and Glamour that said her favorite thing to do was have a boomberry pie party? Let's make her one that goes off like fireworks. Good idea. That's sure to leave an incredible impression. Come on, let's go to the cafe and start baking! Oh, she didn't even like the ones she picked. She ripped them up. Nothing's good enough for her. Come on, Orange. Yeah, come on, this is our did I take? Hello? Help? Anyone? Hello? Hello? Thank you, Cupcake, for rescuing me. Oh, I'm okay. I just lost 
Plasma voice hollering for help. A Boomberry pie party? Oh no! They can't know that I've lost my voice. They will be so let down if I can't sing for the grand opening. She doesn't like us so much. She didn't even come to her own Boomberry pie party. Refills? Anybody? If I have any more tea, I'm gonna float away. Maybe she didn't get our invitation? Maybe she's still in makeup? We better face facts. She knew it wouldn't be as good as she's used to, so she didn't bother. Well, should we? Might as well not let a perfectly good Boomberry pie go to waste. <laughs> We put too many boomberries. Oh, failed again. Girls, the cherry gem you keep describing doesn't sound like the girl I met. We just wanted her to be our friend, for her to like us. <laughs> <laughs> but I guess we're not special enough. I think I have some more towels over at the marketplace. I'll be right back. Disturb getting my superstar beauty rest? <laughs> Cherry, it's me, Strawberry. Can we talk a minute? <gasps> so, I called all of you here this morning because Cherry needs your help. She does? Our help? What happened? Is she okay? Yesterday, she lost her voice. Oh, oh terrible! She's got most of it back, but still can't sing her high notes. So I'm to sing the high notes for her. And she wants you to be the musical and singing backup. Willow, we get to perform with Cherry Jam? Uh-huh. <laughs> There's something else she wants. Very important. She'd ask you herself, but she needs to rest her voice. Anything! Whatever you name wants. anything for Cherry what Jam. What is it? Well, all she really wants is to be your friend. But she wants to know if you'll treat her like a friend, not a superstar. Oh. <laughs> My. We really haven't been acting like friends. We've been acting like... Bands. Who can help me paint the podium? I will! Let's go! Yeah, where's the paint? Let's get going! Rush. <laughs> Welcome to the Marketplace Grand Opening! <laughs> this could never have come together without all your help! And now, presenting for your musical enjoyment! <laughs> Cherry Jam and her friends!
Ringing? I'll tell you my secret, Blueberry. That's because... I turned it off! <laughs> oh, wow! What will your manager say? And my promoter, and my agent, and my stylist, and my trainer, and my publicist, and my tour manager, and my assistant, and, and everyone in Berry Big City, and... <laughs> Lemon, this sunscreen is very wonderfully fragrant. So, uh... Lemony! Glad you like it, Cherry. What about your tour? Girls, I'd like to ask you a favor. Sure, Cherry. Anything! Of course! You name it! I'm going to turn on my phone, call my manager, and tell her I'd like to postpone planning my tour, and... Stay here longer? Really? That's fantastic! You Cherry, that's wonderful! You're welcome to stay as long as you'd like. Thank you so much, Strawberry. I could use a vacation, and I can't think of a better place to take one than Berry Bitty City. <laughs> so, what's on your vacation schedule for today, Cherry? <sighs> I thought I'd sit down by the lake. Blueberry loaned me a thrilling new Patty Persimmon book, Mystery of the Missing Mozzarella. Ooh, sounds like a nice, relaxing way to spend the day. I made you a special cherry turnover for your picnic. Oh, thank you so much, Strawberry. I, I wish I had something for you. Oh, you being here is enough. Have fun. I will. <sighs> See ya! Hmm, I suspected it was the sous chef all along. What was that? One and two and kickball change. Kickball change, other side and kickball change. Very nicely done. <laughs> Hi, Cherry Jam. Hi, Plum. What is that awful noise? Barry Kim Bloom is learning to play the bassoon. He likes to practice in the gazebo. <sighs> now that is music. Get back to class. See you later. And kickball change, kickball change. <laughs> so cute. Come in. Uh huh. Hello there, Cherry. Uh, Lemon, is is that you? Oh, <laughs> sorry. I need to wear these when I do the princess's toes. <laughs> Can bloom in his bassooning, but it is his new passion. <laughs> so, uh, do you need a pedicure? Oh, uh, no, thank you. I'll stop by a little later. Just saying hi. See you later. Bye bye. Yum, souffles. Strawberry, you're such a talented cook. <laughs> Thank you, Cherry. Something special to snack on at the book club tonight. That's very thoughtful of you. <laughs> See! How was the mystery book? Very thrilling! I finished it! Wow! Ready to start another one? Actually... Uh... <laughs> actually, I kind of think I've had enough vacation. Oh. Really? You aren't going back to Berry Big City so soon, are you? Oh, no. no! I love it here. It's just... Well, everyone makes a contribution in Berry Bitty City. I, I mean, Raspberry makes beautiful fashions. Orange makes sure everyone can get whatever they need at her store. 
Plum teaches dancing. I wish... I wish there was something I could do too, Strawberry! A music teacher. That's something you could contribute. Wow, that I can do. <laughs> when can I start? <laughs> Can bloom. <laughs> there yeah. <you> go. <laughs> nice. Thank you for letting us use your studio, Plum. Uh, I'm wondering if you could use it a little more. Huh? We all want to learn to make music, Cherry Jam. Well. Uh, okay! Really good. You're coming along great, Plum. Thank you. This is great. Now I'll be able to keep the beat for my dance students. Well, that's all for today. Tomorrow we'll learn paradiddles. Paradiddles? Sure. Here, I'll show you. You're learning. You'll be doing that with your eyes closed by the time we hold a recital at the end of the week. Recital? Oh, I can't wait. Cherry, wait. What is it, Plum? Well, do we really need to have a recital? <laughs> well, sure. It's customary. Is customary necessary? A recital is a good learning milestone. Something to work for. <laughs> well, that's what my music teacher used to say. Part of the fun of making music is performing it for others. Well, see you tomorrow. Uh-huh. See ya. I better keep practicing. Me on the show 
shoulder. Oh, sorry. I think that was my bow. Oh, no worries. Back under, please. Uh, F. Oh, no, no, G. Uh, Ouch! <laughs> Careful with that thing, Orange. That thing is called a bow. Oh, sorry. <laughs> um, Lemon, could you? Oh, of course. Pardon me. I I think this hand is done soaking. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Girls, do you think it might be possible, pretty please, to do your practicing elsewhere? This is salon time. But we have to practice for the recital. Every moment counts. <laughs> we're sorry, Lemon. You are absolutely right. Girls, we're being rude to Lemon. We all need the talent that Lemon has to offer, so we should show respect for her work and not get in the way. Oh, there Hi, you Chara. are. Hi. How's hey. it going? Girls, I wanted to let you know I'm moving the recital to next Tuesday. Really? But we'll be ready. We've been practicing. No, it's Plum. She sprained her wrist and, and needs a couple more days to recuperate. Oh, no. Poor Plum. That's terrible. Well, that gives us more time to practice. I guess I'll need another salon appointment for the day before. Me too. Me three. Can you put me down for one, too, Lemon? Got it. Raspberry, that's great! You're ready for Tuesday's recital right now! Oh, thanks, Cherry. Uh, I wanted to ask, though, or request, I mean, uh, ask a favor. Sure. Well, Plum just told me she needs a new dress for the recital, and I don't have time to make one, well, to finish one by Tuesday. I feel so bad for her. She's really up... this... upset. She wanted me to ask you. Oh, you really care about her, don't you? Well, I just know how much difference a new dress can make, you know? No problem. Will another day be enough? Sure. Oh, thanks, Cherry. I'll tell the other students. Wednesday it is. Okay, here I come. Ooh, I can't wait. It's going to look smash, uh, terrific, uh, smash terrific on her. Gorgeous. Beautiful dress, Raspberry. It looks exquisite on her. Stunning. Perfect. She'll look great at the recital. Recital. <laughs> Are you okay? Oh, Plum! Oh, poor thing! Uh, uh, let us help you up. Ouch! I don't think I can sit. Oh, I'm so sorry. Poor Plum. Um, in fact, I... I don't think I'll be able to sit at my drum set at all. A at least for a couple of days. Until it's, uh, better. Well, I guess we could put off the recital again. Another day or two? Oh, uh, sure. No problem. That's okay. Sure, Plum. We can wait. Oh, thanks, guys. I really appreciate it. Because I really want to be part of the recital. <laughs> What time is it? The recital isn't until tonight. Uh, that's just the thing, Cherry. You see, I... I can't find my drumsticks. You can't find your drumsticks? No problem. 
I'll help you look. Oh, I'm sure I can find them. All I need is just one more day to look for them, I mean. Another day? But I just baked these for the recital. I know, but poor Plum. She's having so many troubles. Strawberry, is it true? We're postponing the recital again? I'm afraid so. Oh, I was so excited to perform, but now I've built up too much excitement, and I'm, you know, losing my nerve. I can't do everyone's hair and nails every day. I, I just can't do it anymore and practice my bass. I, oh, I just can't do it. But poor Plum, she can't find her drumsticks. Hmm. I think I know where they might be. Let's wait a bit before postponing the recital. I'm gonna go help Plum find what she needs. Ouch! Oh, sorry. You're sure you had your drumsticks when you were picking flowers? Sure. Um, yeah. Well, uh, I think so. Oh, Strawberry, I'm so sorry uh, about delaying the recital and all. I know. I am too. And everyone else. But I thought everyone would be happy to have more time to practice. Well, at first, maybe. But now they've built up so much anticipation, they're all getting nervous. I know it isn't your fault, but... If everyone didn't want to wait, then why did they? Because we care about you, Plum. Oh. Oh, Strawberry. I didn't realize. Everyone's been so kind and patient, and I've been making up excuses to put off the recital. But why? You love to perform. You dance for us all the time. But I'm good at dancing. This is different. I've never performed all by myself at something I make lots of mistakes at in front of people all looking at me. Hmm. You have a point there. Let's see how many mistakes we're talking about. Just you and me. Oh. Okay. If it's just you. <laughs> oh, you found them! <laughs> yeah. Wonder how they got in there. <laughs> <laughs> what did you learn that beat? These are called paradiddles. And every time I try them... <laughs> that happens. Try again, but hold on a little tighter. Oh, Lemon's gotta see this. Can I call her? Oh, well, I guess that'd be okay. If it's just you and Lemon. Hi, Lemon. Lady? Oh, Blueberry's gotta see this! Oh, and look what else Cherry taught me for the recital. Wow, Plum! That's great! I think you really are ready for the recital. Oh? Well, I have an idea. It's not really fair that everyone else hasn't had a chance to warm up. Why don't we all do a number together to start off? Oh, that would be great, Cherry. So, can we let the rest of the audience in? Sure. I'm ready. Thank you, everyone. That's it? The rest of the students are already here. <laughs> oh! I insisted on being invited as a prospective student. <clears throat> I am thinking of taking up the bassoon. Oh, that's oh, great, oh, Princess! Oh, 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 Princess, we could play a duet. As you wish, Barrack and Bloom. As you wish. <laughs> 